I had a date last night. If we go back to my place, everything comes off. Oh, I needs it. Well, oh, I got it. <laughs> Game over. Thanks for playing. I'm assuming that was all in real time. The problem is, I wake up this morning, she's still there. But you should have paid her in advance. It's actually very attractive to women when men are sensitive. Maybe you're right. I once got a happy ending for pretending to cry at my grandma's funeral. Adam and I are taking dance lessons for our wedding because we need all the help we can get. Uh, it's, a, it's a good thing you're holding your hand up so I don't get my feelings hurt. Come on, count. Oh. One, two, three, and back to. Not out loud. Can't you think something without actually saying it? Yeah, I'm doing it right now. <laughs> The Godfather? Really? What? I've been begging you to watch Gone with the Wind forever and you blow me off. Jeff tells you to watch The Godfather and you run out and rent it like you're his bitch? I'm not his bitch. He just makes me do stuff sometimes. Oh, The Godfather. Uh, the reason we're watching The Godfather, Jennifer, is because I finished Gone with the Wind. You did? Mm-hmm, as God is my witness. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Look, it's skin crawling. You're not gonna want to exchange this, my friend. Fifth row center for a little Broadway offering called Wicked. I can't believe you remembered. It's been like four years. That's great. They probably worked out the kinks by now. Wait, Jeff, there's only one ticket in here. I'm not going. That's part of your gift. You don't want to go alone. Yes, you do. No, I want you to go with me. No, you don't. It's more fun to share the experience with someone. Is it? Well, let's examine the last time we shared the theater-going experience. We got to our seats. You mimed killing yourself. Curtain went up. You mimed killing yourself. Three townspeople on stage started to sing. You mimed killing them and then turned the gun on yourself. All right, what am I looking at here? Right. Yeah, down here, this thing is blocking my view of the floor. Just a little hairy rug. I picked it up this morning. All right, so I know what it is and who did it. Still haven't established a motive. Can't I do things to make our home more pleasant without every time having to go through this? Hey, I have to hear this speech every time. You're right, Jeff. You know, why make our apartment nicer? Why buy things? Why have art? Why do anything? That's all I'm saying. <laughs>